so hello guys welcome back to the channel in this video we'll cover another lab that is getting started with the gemini api vertex ai with curl so first of all click on start lab now wait and now open cloud console in in the incognito window sometimes it gets signed in automatically sometimes it asks for username and password for that always refer to the lab instructions now wait for this now click on agree and then agree and continue first of all scroll down now click on agree and continue now in the search box type workbench so click on the workbench So finally we are in the workbench now we have to click on jupyter lab that is open jupyter lab now wait for some time it will open shortly apart from this in case you haven't liked the video like it and do subscribe the channel now finally the vertex ai jupyter notebook is ready so now open the intro gemini curl version 1 now you have to select python 3 as kernel and wait for the kernel status to get idle as you can see it's connecting and is busy so now we have to update the project id and location from here so make sure to check it let's update it meanwhile the kernel is being loaded so here replace the project id and here you have to replace the zone i mean region not zone sorry so here it has been updated now from here click on the play button and now execute the command here now move next now click on run as selected on all below now it will execute all the shells one by one you don't have to click on play button again and again so as you can see the kernel status is still busy now we need to wait till the kernel status gets idle so let's wait so finally the kernel status is idle now we will move forward to the lab instruction and hit check my progress and see whether we get full score or not so as you can see it takes time to update the score so let's hit check my progress via here only So as you can see we got error on some part and some of the check my progress got the score so don't worry you need to wait for some time and let's see so as you can see the task executed perfectly but let me show you what you have to do in such cases so you need to rerun the shells by clicking on play button because sometimes due to internal error the task does not update itself so now just rerun it click on the play button again and again just follow the video as you can see we got the final output here it's loading so finally the all outputs are here now we will hit check my progress for the task let's see finally i think we got full score wait in case it shows like this just refresh the browser as you can see we got full score without any issue and finally we are done with the lab thank you